All right, just for fun, I want to show you can we can make how we can make these motherfuckers spin. All right, this means animations, baby. Look at this beauty. Look at this beauty. I'm gonna come here and I'm gonna create an animation. I'm gonna call this animation rotation. All right. I of course have to import keyframes from style component, and I do keyframes here. Beautiful. And now I make the keyframe animation. So I have to say from into, and here I say transform, all right, rotate 80 degrees, no, zero degrees at the beginning, and then to transform, rotate 360 degrees. All right, and now let's make one component that uses, no, you know what? Mm -mm. Let's do it with props. Yes, let's do it with props. Here I'm going to say, hey man, if this component is the dangerous one, let's do it like that. If props that danger, then we're going to say return animation done and which animation rotation rotation rotate not rotation 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 all right two seconds uh, linear and infinite all right let's check it out and there we go look at this beauty here I'm showing you how you can check for props inside of the CSS um, rule or outside on the of the on the body of the code. Look at this shit. It's unbelievable for me. I mean, for God's sake, isn't this fucking cool? God, it's fucking great, man. All right, that's it for animations. That how that's how easy they are. And that's how cool it is. You can manage props at any times you want. You can check if this has these props, yes or no. Imagine having these with class names. You will have to do check in the class name and oh God, you will have to create a different class in the CSS, a pain in the ass. Here, everything is a function. Everything is a component and everything can have props. Great, all right, great. We could also do this if you want. We could be crazy and here, for example, say rotation time. All right, and here we say three, not five. All right, and imagine that, yeah, let's do it. So here I'm gonna say, instead of the time, I'm gonna just take this and I'm gonna say rotation time. And I'm good, that's it. So now, wah, rotation time is not defined. Of course it's not, what idiot props. Now look, it's five seconds only. Look at how cool it is, man. I don't know if you realize, but we are changing the style with the props. The props are going directly to the style, immediately. No class name bullshit, no anything apart from that. If you wanted to implement something like this in CSS, at least you will have to have one, two, three class names. And also you won't be able to change the animation speed from your um, component. You wouldn't be able to set any animation speed and change it in your CSS file. That wouldn't be possible. If you wanted to change the rotation time in CSS, you will have to do it with a state or some stuff like that. It, it wouldn't be possible. Look at this. Look at how cool it is. Awesome. See you on the next video.